a vortex water revitalizer treat bacteria in your water? Yes, it does. The implosion process restructures the water in such a way that the, it becomes a, an inhospitable environment for anaerobic bacteria such as E. coli and coliform bacteria. In fact, in lab tests, it's shown that um, the, the, these bacteria are completely eliminated from the water entirely. Right. And what about heavy metals? Can you tell me about heavy metals in water? Well, the great thing about the way the vortex works is that it has a centrifugal and centripetal effect on the actual molecules. So elements such as heavy metals that are dissolved in the water are, are thrown to the outside and therefore separated from the water molecules and form their own microclusters. And that means that, again, they are separate from the water and they're not absorbed by the body in right. the way they normally would be. So normally, uh, through regular tap water, the heavy metals uh, are very minute, so what you're saying is they stick to the cells. Yeah. And once they go through the rotting revitalizer, they actually become microclustered and they become big and they fall through the body. Yes, they, they don't now pass into your bloodstream in the same way right. they used to. They now just pass through the body without actually going through your bloodstream. Wow, very good. Whereas before they would have been carried into the bloodstream with the water molecules. Right.